adding a beautiful and professional intro to your YouTube videos make them look appealing and also enhances their professional appeal. It serves as a hook to audience mind. Intros and outros are very important to have so your audience knows who you are and can show that you have a brand. In this tutorial, I will show you how you can create a cool and professional intros and outros for your channel with a free online tool. Right now, we are going to head to this website called flexiclip.com. From the home page, we can see different uh, categories of video that we can create from real estate to explainer to education, promo, corporate, tutorial. And then we go to lifestyle, we can see photography, video, by the video, wedding video, baby video, travel video, music video, then back to social media. You can see YouTube video. This is our concern for today. Then we can see Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter video. So right now, for us to edit any category, we have to log in. So you create account if this is your first time. So sign up with a free account and then enter your email and password. Right now, I'm going to log in and go into my dashboard and pick a category and then show you how you can edit and export it. So right now, I'm in my dashboard after I've logged in into my account. And this is what we are going to see when you log in. So at the top here, you will see your project. If you have created a project before, you see like my here, I've created like a five out of a free 12 project that are available for this free account. So after which I have to upgrade to continue using this uh, website. So at this top, at the, at the left corner here, we see... Uh, project home then create or from scratch so you can select from either of these so and then when you come here we will see different categories of um, videos that we can create our focus for today is to create an intro for our youtube video so right now i'm going to head straight to the intros part so that we can see how we can use this to create um our intros for intros and outro for our YouTube video. So when you click on all, so it will take you to this place where you can select from the categories intros and outro. This is our focus. Don't forget we are making intros and outro. Click on that, then we can see from the side here the available intros and uh, outros that are here. So when you over your mouse over it, so you can see the video. So as you can move around and see different um, different intros and outros that you can select from. So right now I'm going to click this um, intro, this logo intro. Then I click on customize. Clicking on the customize take me to this uh, place where I can edit this um, intro. So first, I want to change the logo to my logo. So you click on the logo, then at the top here, you see upload logo. So if you don't know how to create logo, I've given a tutorial previously. This, the, the link to the video is given in the description. So I'm going to pick from one of my logo here, then just click on open. To upload the logo here as you can see the logo is right here right here then I'm going to click on the company name then at the top here you see this uh, pencil icon for for editing the text click on the text to edit the text here I can change the name here then from this website I can just put my the other part of my um, channel name here So I'm clicking on OK. 
so you can see it here you can also apply formatting to the text from up here you can change the font style so you can select the font style that you want from up here then you can also make it bold so the bold is not available for the uh, font selected so you can change it to other font so if bold is available you can see it's already bold so here that is how to edit the text so apart from editing editing the text you can also come to this side to add text to this um, intro if there is need for that so you can just click on the title if that is the text is title that you want to add so you can click on the uh, title text and then put it here so if you don't want, you don't like this one you can delete it from here so at the corner here you can see remove so you can remove this one and then enter another text right now i don't need to add this text i'm just going to delete it from here then as, aside from that you can also add overlay here so when you move around you can see different uh, overlay for text then overlay for decoration then logo and intros so you can add any overlay to this uh, intro as you can see so this one will move this one up and if you want to show your social media you can see that so they are at the top here you can press undo to undo this then you can add another overlay to this one so as you can see so you can add overlay then also you can add um, element to your intro so if there is need for that you can add element that you can add shapes different um or uh, different shapes social media icon you can add them to your intro so depending on your creativity and how you want your intro to be so this website give us a lot of uh, features that we can add to our intro so as you can see the um element overlay is showing here so you can add subscribe you can add a like as the case may be so depending on your creativity so you can as well change the background if you want to add background to your intro so when you click on the background you can see different um, background that if you want to change this um, the default background to this intro you can as well uh, come here and uh, change the uh, background so aside from that you can also add um, music to the intro if you don't like the default uh, music so you can come here and then change the uh, intro uh, music so you can also in reduce the volume or increase it then fade in and fade out you can uh, apply that as well to the intro so then apart from that like i said the, the at the beginning this website give us the opportunity to add our own watermark to this video as you can see there is no watermark of this website on the preview of the video and when we export it this is the same thing that we are going to see there won't be any watermark on the video unlike some other website that even the preview you have their watermark on it so there is no way to remove that so there is no watermark on the video that you are going to produce from this so it gives us the opportunity to add our own watermark so you can add text watermark or you can add image watermark so if i want to add a watermark like let's say i want to use my logo for the watermark i just click on uh, browse image then i select one of my logo from here and then click on ok so it will upload this one and you can see at, at the preview here, you can see the watermark of my logo at the top so if you are producing um uh, maybe an explainer video or you are, you are explaining something so there will be need to add your watermark and if for intros you don't need um, watermark for, for other videos you can add your watermark so i'm going to remove watermark because this is just an intro so remove the watermark then last one on that wall uh, more here you can select the ratio of the um intro so if you are making it for mobile on the one one ratio one to one so you can click on that as you can see on from the preview or you are making 19 by 9 by 16 aspect ratio or 4 by 5 or 
the 21 by 9. So you can select the aspect ratio that you want. So let's go back to the default 16 by 9 um, aspect ratio. So which is the original um, or the where we started from. So I'm making this uh, intro for 16 by 9 aspect um, ratio. So you select your ratio from here. So I, I, another thing that you can do here is that you can duplicate this um, intro. So maybe you want to make it long. So when you come under here, you can see play to play the uh, intro and then also click on the plus to add more more you can add as many as possible you can copy and then add more so maybe you want to add or you want to add so many uh, many other things to your intro aside from this uh, display so maybe for your channel you want to introduce what your channel is all about so the things that you do on your channel you can create a um, duplicate of this so and then in between this one you can also uh, apply transition to this so when you click on transition it will give you the option to change the transition from here you can see different uh, category of transition that you can apply between your uh, each clip on the timeline to select this one wipe off so i'm going to select that and uh, click on uh, apply to apply the transition to the between the two clips there so also one other thing that we can do right here, like I've said before, so we can add um, local file to this uh, intro. Then also you can make recording. Maybe you want to do voiceover. Um, you can record uh, the screen. You can record from a uh, webcam. So also you can add stock media to your, your intros. Uh, this is just um, a quick tutorial on how to use this uh, website to create intro for yourself. This might not be the best of intro, so depend on your own uh, creativity and how you want your intro to be. So you can make use of all the features available from this uh, website, from text, overlay, element, background, music, watermark, and the, uh, the aspect ratio that you want your uh, intros to be. So when you are done, you can click on the preview button to preview it, or you can just click on... Um, export so you click on export so this is the main eating this is the read this so at this point here after you have uh, customized you have edited the in, uh, intro it is now the time for you to take it to your computer where you can use it for your videos and upload to youtube so it gives you the opportunity to upload uh, to export your intros with mp4 or as gif so we right now we are exporting this as a mp4 then we have the resolution for 80p, 720p, and then 1080p. So depending on the uh, resolution that you want to uh, export your video with, so you have to give credit to this uh, website. So at the, at the, when you are exporting this, you have two options. Either you upgrade and pay to download this. Don't be scared. Uh, this website gives us the opportunity to download this video, this intro. This website gives us the opportunity to download this intro. The watermark is at the beginning. And as an editor, you can remove these um, uh, intros, the watermark intro from the videos, and you can use it. But at the same time, you have to give credit to this website in your, uh, your social media whenever you are using the, the uh, services because this is a very cool app. So other uh, websites that are giving us this opportunity to make intros, they will add their watermark even in their preview. There, there is no way... You can remove it without distorting your uh, intro. So I'm going to export this one as um, 1080p, which is a very high resolution. So if I click on this, at the, top, at the bottom here, you see upgrade and export, which if I click on that, it asks me to register for upgrade my account to paid account so that they, I can download without watermark. But at the second option down here, you can see or export the video for free with FlexiClip intro. That is the watermark I'm talking about. They are adding to the video, not adding any logo to your output. The intro is at the beginning and it's not even extended to the video at all. So right now I'm going to show you what it's all about. So when you click on this, this is what I'm talking about here. So you can type the name of the video. Let's call this uh, video intro. Okay. Created by who? Type your name. For the time's sake, I will show you a, another tutorial that I've uh, created with this website and how the export will look like with their intro watermark. So watch this video and see how the watermark look like.
have enjoyed this uh, tutorial kindly give a like to this uh, video and also subscribe and share this video for others to benefit from me thank you for watching this video i will see you in my next tutorial